Well, this is a budget Lara Giddings has said is about jobs. Um, 6,000 jobs have been lost uh, since the first Green Labor uh, budget back in 10-11. Um, this budget delivers record deficits and over the forward estimates, the budget papers are covered in red ink as well. The promised surplus has disappeared. This budget uh, demonstrates once and for all that Lara Giddings is not a good financial manager. We certainly uh, note that uh, Treasury has forecast that there has been a decline in economic growth over this past year. And no one could deny that we haven't been facing some tough and challenging times. But importantly, Treasury is forecasting growth from now on. Uh, is Tasmania in a recession? Well, Treasury's own forecasts indicate that this year the current uh, financial year, Tasmania will be in a recession. Firstly, I'd take you up on the point that we don't know as yet whether or not we were in fact in recession in the past year. We won't know that until November of this year when we have the ABS official statistics come out. We've been re uh, making this point to Lara Giddings now for the last 12 months and if she didn't act, she didn't stimulate the economy, that Tasmania was headed for a recession. Treasury's own forecasts in her budget indicate that we will be in a recession this year. We uh, always have a debate around forecasts. It's a debate that's been had just recently in the Commonwealth Parliament as well. None of us have a crystal ball. I'd love to have one. I'd be worth a fortune if I did. What would a Liberal government do differently? Well, last year we announced as part of our plan for a brighter future for Tasmania uh, to bring down a budget, a response to the budget that was fiscally responsible, that stimulated the, co the economy and importantly uh, provided a, road, a, a way back in regards to funding for essential services to rebuild health, education and police. We have uh, been managing the downsizing of the police service in line with other parts of government and I can assure you that uh, every part of government has had to pull their belt in. Uh, when we bring down our alternative budget on Tuesday, once again it will be fiscally responsible, it will stimulate the economy and importantly it will rebuild those essential services of health, education and police. We're also investing in major infrastructure, in health, in education and in irrigation. Well, the deficit's 50% larger this current year than what was originally forecast. Uh, and certainly Lara Giddings was, for, was uh, telling people as late as December last year that we'd be returning to surplus this current budget year. So in regards to the deficit she's delivered, no, I wasn't surprised. We had uh, some unforeseen circumstances in this current financial year that we, we couldn't predict the impact of. Um, we've been asking the Premier questions about a $400 million deficit now for the last uh, two or three months. Uh, I expected it to end up here simply because we understand what a poor financial manager Lara Giddings is.